How much do you have to know about what you're doing to be guilty of a crime? The New York Court of Appeals explored this trippy question in People v. Ryan. Robert Ryan asked his friend, David Hopkins, to order a shipment of hallucinogenic mushrooms for him. Hopkins called a mutual friend in San Francisco and requested the, quote, usual shipment, unquote. After receiving a tip, a police officer intercepted the package and arrested Hopkins. Hopkins agreed to participate in a supervised delivery to Ryan. Hopkins called Ryan and said that he had the package and that there was a load of mushrooms in it. Ryan responded that he knew there were a lot of mushrooms, and Hopkins replied that the package was around two pounds. Ryan later met Hopkins, who gave Ryan a package stuffed with newspaper. Police then arrested Ryan. At the time, state law made it a felony to knowingly possess 625 milligrams of a hallucinogen, which is one thousandth of a pound. Ryan was convicted of knowingly possessing more than 625 milligrams of a hallucinogen. Ryan appealed to the appellate division, arguing that he didn't know how much hallucinogen was in the package. The appellate division affirmed the conviction, holding that the term knowingly only applied to possession of the drug and not its exact weight. Ryan appealed to the New York Court of Appeals.